It's one of the biggest and most expensive projects ever taken on by the city of Austin. Today, the city council took a field trip to water treatment plant number four near the intersection of 620 and 2222. The future of that plant is a little uncertain right now because some city council members believe the project is a waste of money and is not needed. KXAN City reporter Reagan Hackleman has more on this controversial project. Well, the city council heard a 30 minute presentation from the construction manager here at water treatment plant number four. He basically said that construction on this massive project is about 15% complete. Back in 2008, the city council approved starting this half billion dollar project. Construction has been underway for just under a year now. The city has spent close to about $150 million so far and have already signed contracts for another $300 million worth of work. On any given day, there are between 130 and 150 people working on the plant. That number is expected to be closer to 300 as construction moves forward. Now, this is all important because the council is currently waiting to find out how much it'll cost the city to stop work on the project and put it on hold for five to 10 years. Some of the council believe it was wrong to start construction saying the plant is simply not needed. Council member Kathy Tovo, the newest council member, says that she would not have voted for the plant in the first place, but she does think it was good for them to see everything firsthand. I think it's important for us to see the level of construction that's taken place and the kind of level of activity here on the site every day. So it definitely is a, an important piece of information to factor into our decision making process. The city did not know exactly how much it cost the city council to hold a special meeting out here. We do know that the deck that the council meeting was held on was specifically built for that meeting, but the city tells us they will use it for other meetings in the future. The council should know exactly how much it'll cost to stop construction and put this plant on hold for five or 10 years sometime in early September. Reporting from Northwest Austin, Reagan Hackleman, KXAN News.